welcome back all the regular viewers and uh, my subs and uh, and uh, I'd like to welcome also all the, all the new people who are viewing for the first time um, this is gonna be one of my uh, real or fake you decide uh, episodes uh, I've been away for a little bit over a week and um, you know just the day after Christmas so you know I thought I could uh, uh, 2009 I thought I could you know make a few more PSAs for you because there's plenty of stuff people keep sending me links and um, asking questions and stuff like that and uh, one of my subs uh, pointed out this individual and you know I'd like to introduce another new uh, scammer on eBay uh, uh, wheeling and boarding uh, he only has 22 uh, positives there but he said you know check this guy out because everything he has listed for sale is fake so I uh, checked it out yep I think you know he warrants the video but what I'm going to do is instead of showing all the fakes I'm going to do something a little different like I said um, he has 14 items available at this time it's a uh, fake Adrian Peterson he has a uh, fake uh, Chris Johnson with the SP authentic obviously the most common uh, fake patches out there today. Uh, this is a Chris Johnson fake number to 999. Immediately followed by another uh, Chris Johnson and a Jones uh, dual auto with uh, two fake uh, Reebok patches in there. And then on uh, this uh, Chris Johnson SP Authentic, obviously number to 999 with a Reebok patch in there. And another Felix Jones, uh, exquisite, uh, wh what's in there? The, yep, the one right on the left here is the, uh, fake, uh, Reebok patch. Who would have ever thought, uh, Felix Jones, uh, uh, SP Authentic fake, a Joe Flacco fake, a lot of those fake, uh, Joe Flaccos. Um... And then there's a uh, Jonathan Stewart fake, obviously SP authentic again. Now this one here is a little different. So, uh, so Larry Bird, there's an auto there with just a plain white patch in uh, number to I guess to 25. He says, um, which is a little surprising since, like I said, everything else he sounds fake. We have here a Lawrence Maroney uh, rookie auto patch, the fake patch in there. Um, now here's uh, SP Authentic to the 499 Matt Ryan. We'll take a look at that just in a minute. And then we have Ray Rice here, which is SPX Auto. There's three awesome patches in there. I forgot what the numbering was, but he calls it a number one because it's a you know best looking SPX Ray Rice I've ever seen. Uh, you know because uh, it's uh, the, the chopped up uh, logo in there. Um, three pieces of the chopped up logo and uh, let's just keep continuing here because there's uh, two more Ray Rice's in here it's a fake SPA Authentic and then another fake uh, Ray Rice now um, if you remember uh, on the 17th I posted uh, the uh, sp uh, special edition uh, for uh, Ray Rice uh, uh, PSA because so many people ask the uh, questions about them so you know I, there's, I thought it deserved its own episode I want to do a quick update after that uh, after this one here uh, something uh, else you guys should see but like I said let's do a real or fake now I'm going to go back up here to the Matt Ryan because just by just without even clicking on a link just giving a quick glance it looks just like a piece of a name or number and that's uh, supposedly numbered to 4.99. So, you know, there's nothing really there that, after a quick inspection, would lead me to think that it's fake. But what did I just show you? Virtually everything else he has listed is fake. So, you know, it's like a red flag. So, if there's something now. If you remember the Adrian, uh, Adrian Peterson one I did, showed some of the fakes that were altered when I showed the proof before and after. Some of the cards had um. You know, they just improved them from uh, the, the uh, originals. Now, hopefully somebody could show me the original for this. I'm not going to bother searching for it. Um, you know, it's a day after Christmas. and uh, But hopefully it'll appear so that I could show you uh, before and after. But 
I'm just going to let you decide for this one, like I said. There's the item number if you're interested, and uh, item locations on the East Coast. Uh, a lot of fakes are coming out of Jersey recently, so I don't know if that means anything there. Now, here's a, the card. Now, he has a very nice camera. You can see the detail with everything in the background. And for whatever reason, he doesn't really get close onto the card. But he's new, you know, he, he maybe, you know, doesn't have it down yet. And then if you go over here, if you see, the card is numbered, supposed to be numbered, 300 out of 499. Okay, it's one of the best Matt Ryans you could own. Now, here is, uh, the, uh, you know, one of my regular uh, red flags. This is a private listing. For another new, and it, what basically means is it says right there, uh, somebody asked about this, a few people have, and, uh, you know, it just says your identity will not be exposed to anyone except the seller. So that means if you bid on this, nobody's going to know who bid except the seller. And somebody else pointed out that a lot of the shill uh, bidders do that, uh, you know, when they got the shill scam going on. I'll explain that later, but um, in another video probably, but... Uh, it's not important for this one here. Okay, so here it is. Now, it could be legit, but without even blowing it up, you can see just like a little bit of damage right there and there on the little frame here. I mean, it, and it's actually in the same spot above and uh, below. And I don't know if you could tell, without even blowing up by the number, that doesn't look like a 300 to 499 right there. Now, even if you do blow it up, it doesn't get that much better. But you could see more clearly the little damage here and here. Okay, another red flag. But then, we would number. I mean, can you tell what it says there? It looks like a 427 out of 499. So, I don't know, maybe somebody at eBay, who, if you're looking at this uh, listing here, can explain why he, he's listing this card as a, th you know, uh, 300 out of 499 when it's obviously something else. I mean, it doesn't matter what the number is, it's obviously not 300. And it says here, 300 out of 499. And so, you know... And it says here, picture of actual card. So, you know, I mean, well, <clears throat> so, you know, like I said, you guys, yeah, I'll leave this one up to your imagination. You can decide for yourself. That's why I do these. Um, I just give you the info and let you guys pick. And then if you, like I said, you want to look at all these other fakes he has listed, uh, be my guest. I'm just surprised he didn't, it really doesn't it look like he did anything to it. Like I said, it just looks like a plain white for the Larry Bird, and it is number 25. I'm not, well, it says here number 25, so I'm surprised he didn't put a Reebok logo in there. So, uh, you know, uh, keep your questions coming in comments, and, uh, you know, if you can get around to it, uh, uh, thank you, and uh, have a good, hope you guys are staying warm, and uh, have a... Hope you guys had a happy Christmas, and if I don't uh, get around to it or if I'm unavailable otherwise, I'd like you all you guys to have a Merry New Year. Thank you again, and as always, you know, dream big, because, you know, little dreams ain't worth dreaming. Most of the time, anyway. There you go.